Alright guys, White Rose here. Um, I was fumbling around on YouTube the other day, and I was hoping that somebody could read the books in Skyrim to me. But as it turns out, nobody has uploaded any books read, you know, out loud um, on Skyrim. So I took it upon myself to uh, do it for you guys. Um, before that, anyways, I planned on... Um, I planned on having like my own huge library. I wanted to like collect all the books in Skyrim and have them like in my house in the game. I don't have a house yet, but when I do, it's just gonna be packed with every book of Skyrim. It's gonna be awesome. Anyways, so I took it upon myself to uh, read the books for you guys. For anybody that wants to go on YouTube and just get into the lore of Skyrim, because that's half the fun of this game is the lore. And uh, so yeah, that's about it, really. And then um. If you guys care about my character, I'm a dark elf. I'm going mage. Right now, I'm in the college of uh, shoot, what do you call it? The college of college of Winterhold. There we go. Uh, A.K.A. the Mages Guild. For those of you familiar with uh, Oblivion, this is basically the Mages Guild, but it's called the College of Winterhold in Skyrim. So yeah, I'm gonna read you guys a book today. Um, the first book not of a series but of my video series um, so yeah it's gonna be a short book today because this is the intro version I wanted to just introduce the whole you know library reading the books out loud to everybody so yeah um, today I selected the spirit of Nern um, for those of you guys that don't know Nern is the world that all this is taking place in Tamriel is the continent that all this is taking place in and Skyrim is the country that all this is taking place in. Cyrodiil is the country right below Skyrim, and that was all of Oblivion, you know, Elder Scrolls Four. So, Spirit of Nern. This is basically a Spirit of the World. So let's check this out. Okay, Spirit of Nern. First, I like to say that I'm not an expert reader, especially with these weird names in this game these weird places I'm sure you guys can understand so if I mess those up I apologize second of all I like to say that I didn't write any of these books the makers of Skyrim did you know I don't want anybody uh, witch hunting me because you know I copyright stole or whatever um, this is all Skyrim the makers you know best of the games all that they made these books not me I'm just providing a service and reading them to you guys so yeah let's go spirit of nerd Lorcan is the spirit of Nern, the god of all mortals. This does not mean all mortals necessarily like him or even know him. Most elves hate him, thinking creation as that act which sundered them from the spirit realm. Most humans re revere him, or aspects of him, as the herald of existence. The creation of the mortal plane, the Mundus. Nern is a source of mental anguish to all living things. All souls known deep down they came originally from somewhere else, and that Nern is a cruel, crucial step to what comes next. What is this next? Some wish to return to the original state, the spirit realm, and Lorcan is the demon that hinders their way. To them, Nern is a prison, an illusion to escape. Others think that Lorcan created the world as the testing ground for transcendence. To them, the spirit realm was already a prison, that true escape is now finally possible. Hmm, that was interesting. Um, I would take this book, but it looks like the librarian over here is watching me, so he doesn't want me to steal it. But, um, <clears throat> so yeah, um, summary. I think I should give you guys a little summary, just in case you guys didn't understand any of that. Basically, the spirit of Nern, he created the world, um, he created Nern for everyone to live in. And it's kind of like the Matrix thing. It's like, either you th view it as a prison or you view it as an opportunity. So yeah, some obviously the elves, you know, said they d don't like the spirit of Nern because they trap them and they can't go to the spirit world. And the humans do; they like it. So, because he created the mortal plane. So that's that. Uh, see you guys next time. I don't know yet what uh, books I'll be reading next time. I'm thinking the thief, uh, just because it's a simple, fun book. Um, other than that, comment, rate, um, don't, you know, if you want to subscribe, go ahead, but I can't make any promises, so, whatever about that, um, 
And if you want, suggest a book for me to read. I'll read it for you. Alrighty.